Alright, so I'm getting ready to test this POA valve on my 1970 Nova with the original air conditioning. The pilot operated absolute suction throttling valve is this guy here, which sits at the exit of the evaporator, and it keeps the evaporator pressure at a constant so that the evaporator doesn't uh, get too cold and freeze. And I've adapted the service port here uh, with a little coupling from Napa so I can connect it to a set of R. 134A refrigerant gauges. These are just some cheap Harbor Freight uh, refrigerant gauges. I'm just looking to, using the low side right now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some compressed air with this nozzle into the evaporator. This is the inlet of the evaporator at the thermostatic expansion valve. And hopefully this will open up uh, at 30 psi and maintain 30 psi inside the evaporator. So let's see what happens. like we're getting darn near close to 30 psi maybe 29 pretty good and that's all that POA valve does so it's currently calibrated for R12 and there's an adjustment inside so it should lower the pressure I can lower the pressure to be appropriate for R134 it's at 29 ish right now we'll probably drop it a couple psi so it's more appropriate for our 134 which has a lower pressure for the same temperature. Alright, looks like it's working. That's good.